Hallelujah by Leonard Cohen. What a classic, of course, made even more famous by Shrek. And it was a Christmas number one for Alexander Burke. Why is it useful? Singers, it's mostly pentatonic, so you can try out runs, neighbour notes, appoggiaturas, falls, etc. Really great for melodic decoration, and because the melody has lots of repeated notes, you have lots of opportunity to experiment. Pianist and organist, fantastic for beginners in particular, because we can move it into F sharp major, and it's mostly the black notes. Easier to find those patterns. You only need your thumb on B and F, or it will be known as E sharp in this case. So, it's a great one for beginners and for singers. Let's have a look at the solfege. Mi so 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 la la la. Mi so 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 mi so la la la. So la 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 so 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 fa so so. Mi fa so 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 la la ti so do do do. Do la do do re do re 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 mi 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 re 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 do do. Mi so la la, la so so mi mi. Mi so la la, la so so mi fa mi re do do. Now you might have noticed most of the melody began on mi frequently. That's great for improvising for vocalist, pianist and organist because when you start on different degrees of the scale it opens your imagination up. We could do that on our scales as well. So if we think about F sharp major we need our long fingers on the black notes then we've got a white note B there's our F or E sharp so what if we were to practice beginning and ending on different degrees? So what about Re? And then Mi, as in Hallelujah. And now what about improvising starting on Mi? It takes you into new territory. It creates new ideas. It's a great improvisation tip. Just start on a different degree of scale and see what happens. Let's see what we can do.